Hello folks, we're going to be doing a little bit of uh, The Binding of Isaac. Something a little bit new, something a little bit fun. Uh, I may have put up a recording of the original of this at some point, I don't remember. So you can see I've already played a little bit of it. Um, I'm going to go in as Osriel, one of my uh, favorite characters to go in as. is incredibly strong in The Binding of Isaac. Uh, so your, your major disadvantage with him, obviously, is a very short range, and all you have is temporary hearts at this point. The uh, black hearts are a new thing in in Rebirth that allow you to, um, uh, what is this? It hurts so good. Plus five bombs. Okay. Huh. Um, the black hearts, when they, uh, when you lose it, uh, whatever, it will basically allow you to, um, damage the enemy. It, it does like an AOE death card. So it's pretty good. That's really good. That's not as good. Um, so Azrael is is a really really strong starting player. Uh, if you didn't see there, I did go in on hard. Um, hard has basically been what I've been playing everything on. Ah, the spirit heart, not bad. Um. Is there a lot more to... Now there's another room. I generally like to try and get all the rooms I can in the beginning. Uh, I just find it your best chance of survival early. And Lust. Lust is a very easy thing to kill, especially because he can't go over walls at all, and I can. And a Health Up card. That is amazingly good luck. This is going to be a good run. I can feel it. So, Osriel is a little bit OP. Uh, what am I... He's a lot of bit OP. Um, so, the hardest part is just those temporary hearts, but... Oh, God! The other hard part that he has is, um, you know, uh, the small enemies. So, like, flies and crap like that, he's going to do much weaker against... Oh, man, 2 HP up. That is really, really good. Uh, so he's going to do much weaker against flies and things like that, um, just because he needs to have that charge. But on the advantage of it, he, he does that AoE right from the beginning. Uh, I don't remember, I think it was because I made a ton of deals with the devil. Health down, perfect, alright. So that kind of fucks you. Oh! And if you accidentally cancel your stream early, that can be bad. So, I, I've beaten the game now with Isaac, with uh, although I haven't gotten into um, Hell yet, or, or the box, or anything like that. I haven't gotten nearly that far. Assuming that's still in this uh, recreation of it, I, I would assume Blue Baby and all that has to be. Um, I don't think I ever Platinum Godded the, uh, the original. I know I, I know I Golden Godded it um, before, whatchamacallit, came out, the Wrath of the Lamb. But at that point, like, um, I was already much, much busier. Like, what I used to do a lot with uh, Isaac was I would play it a ton at my old job. Uh, my old job was basically I was, a mon I was an engineer, um, IT engineer stuff. And uh, I would basically monitor networks and servers and, you know, answering calls, firewall rules, stuff like that, log into the firewall, uh, pretty, pretty basic stuff. Um, but uh, what what it basically led to was it was a 24-7 company, uh, was weird 12-hour shifts, long hours, uh, and on the weekends you were kind of forced to work. So I had a ton of weekends where, like, just nothing would go on. So I just play Isaac. You know, I mean, it was one of those games that you can play for a little while. Up, oh, I got to pause it and do something. What do you do? Big, beautiful fly. Oh, do you just fly around killing shit? That's cool. So I would have a ton of free time at work and be like, all right, well, you know, I may as well be productive and play Isaac. So. Uh, other than that, my uh, my favorite champion, well, champion, friggin' League of Legends. Uh, my favorite character before this, Azrael definitely being my favorite now, is was... Um, Oh, he explodes too. That's good to know. He probably comes back at the end of this. Yep. 
uh, was Judas. Judas was such a great character. Judas or um, I really liked uh, Cain. The bloated ovum. I don't think I... Oh, no. I know him from at least the original. Although that's new. I don't think you did that before. And we've got a spirit heart, too. Or, uh, I'm sorry, a discolored rock. But, huh, lucky enough, turned into a spirit heart. What's all this? Ooh. Health! Uh, oh, my God. That luck. Lemon party. Health down? No, thank you. We'll be done with you. What do we have in here? Oh, huh. Funny enough, I mentioned the um, Judas. I don't know what the dude on the right does. Uh, but I am going to get the Book of Belial. Uh, so those are the deal with the devil rooms. Um, you can trade a hit point for an item. To me, that's absolutely worth it. Uh, the Book of Belial increases your damage. And that's going to be one of the big things at the end game that you'll really need a lot of is damage. Uh, especially against your bosses, it's really good to just kind of get in on them. Uh, because you don't have a lot of range, you can't even really... You can't rely on your, your reflexes as much. Um, the, the enemies are just going to be too fast for you to really deal with. You can see... You'll see how insane the game gets. I don't know what you do. But I can do that. So um, one of the, the cool abilities, the uh, Azrael also starts with the... And I think you can go right back in. Yep. Azrael starts with uh, the Fool card, which takes you back to the beginning of the game. Oh, shit! Why did that happen? And I think that's nine lives. I don't want that. I don't remember. Ah, fuck me. Oh my god. And I think there should be one more wave. Yeah, I didn't expect... Nope, I didn't expect stuff to spawn there. I probably should have used my Book of Belial in there. I kind of forgot I had it. Oh my god. I thought they were all... Fuck. That's really bad. Well, not horrible for the game, just me ba playing badly. And we're good. Let's take a little drink. Lemon Party will be useful against a boss. But flight in this game is very, very important. If you can get to flying, uh, you'll you can see the major benefit that has, especially for getting items. And uh, there will be rooms where enemies can't fly, and that's really that's really what this game becomes about. Um, and what I, I kind of liked a lot about it, I, I really enjoy roguelike games just because I I think there's an infinite replayability for them. Um, but it, it really demands kind of reflexes and uh, quick thinking, but also it demands knowing, oh, more damage from bombs. That's actually really good. Ah, oh, fuck. I'm not playing well. So, as you saw, I am going on hard. Um, there we go. Which, uh, believe it or not, tends to be pretty freaking hard. I mean, we do still have two hearts, which is awesome. Um, I think that's one of the things in hard that I've noticed is that a lot fewer hearts drop. There we go. And the blind spiders like that just fire out three. Uh, where do I have to go? Uh, you know, we'll take the boss on, but... I'm a little bit afraid of my guy, my helper. There we go. 
I could have used Lemon Party on him, but he was pretty simple, and I wasn't too concerned. Another hit point. That's awesome. I don't. I know that it's in the original. Uh, it's Guppy's Paw. I don't actually remember what it does. I think it allows you to sacrifice one full heart point for spirit hearts, but I might be thinking of a different item. Uh, with 15 coins, I am going to go into the shop. I have no idea what that is, so it's worth it. Giant spiders and flies. Okay, I hope I... It's a good thing for me. I'm not sure. Oh, heart. I don't think I can even... No, nope, I can't even do it anyway if I wanted to. Uh, those are the sacrifice rooms. You sacrifice hit point, and you have a chance of um, getting an item. Oh my god! Stop it. So obviously in this game too, you uh, lose temporary hearts before you lose full hearts. Um, you know, just kind of how it is. But if, if you haven't played the game before, uh, and you're a little bit hesitant on twin stick shooters, I, I still recommend it. It's it's a lot of fun. Um, it's, a, it's a really just addicting game. I find myself uh, constantly having like one bad run where I just hate the game, but I, I can't stop playing. Then I gotta play again. And really, anything that's pulled me away from Dragon Age Inquisition at this point has to be a good game. Oh, fuck! I forgot he... That's not a good companion. Fucking little bomb fly is... That's what you guys do. Come on. Come on. Open. Open! Bitch. There we go. Open. 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 And you kind of just start learning, you know, your fingers working independently and everything. It's... Oh, the fucking... Oh, wait. Did he actually hurt me? I don't think he actually hurts me. Ah, balls of steel. That's not bad. I will take the lemon party still. Um, we're in fine shape for the boss. We'll just take him. Gertie, actually a good boss to use lemon party on. Uh, actually, uh, that worked out perfectly. Gertie's a boss that doesn't move at all. What? That really hit me? God, I suck. Ah, the spoon. A little speed up. Pretty, pretty princess. I don't remember what it does, and so I'm not going to go for it. I like keeping my hit points right now. Uh, the hit points don't seem super important. It seems like I'm doing fine. Um, the game does really get exponentially harder. Oh my god, I didn't even use my Book of Belial on that fight. Granted, I guess I was in fine shape because of... Uh, Lemon party, but... Woo! And with that increased speed, that should really make a difference. Come on, open up. There you go. I actually don't know. I've, I've picked up a couple ranged weapons before on Osriel, and I don't think it matters. I think he still continues to shoot at the same range. Oh, that's really good. Damage and health up. I'm actually... I'm I'm getting really lucky on items. I mean, there's obviously better items. There's obviously things that could work better for me. But uh, the, the current setup that I've got is really strong. Plus, being on hard, I just feel better. Ah... I thought he was going to throw the other way. I missed, uh, misjudged that. Oh, and if you bomb a wall, uh, like you saw there. Oh, this, sorry, this, uh, thing, you need to have, like, no life left. You need to have, like, minimum hearts left. Uh, real red hearts to enter those rooms. Shit. Come on. 
I still don't know what that uh, item I bought did. The giant spiders and flies. I'm not noticing anything, but... Beautiful. Puberty. I actually don't really know what that does either, but apparently I don't want puberty because he looked very sad about it. Probably no girls want to date Isaac. Or Osriel in this case. That's not a discolored rock, is it? No, I think I'm just losing my mind. I generally miss those discolored rocks. I'm pretty bad at that. Is this catacombs already? Yeah, the depths. That's what I meant to say. So this is getting towards the end. Oh, yeah, see, this isn't so bad. They they attract you in, but obviously doesn't make a difference to me because I can fly. Oh, God. I kind of got screwed up by my bomb fly. Oh, wait. Where the hell did they come from? Nice chest. <laughs> Actually, didn't even mean it that way. Come on, dude. Uh, oh, with Chubbs, who is this boss, you can do this. Uh, I planted a bomb there, if you didn't see. And he eats the bomb. Like that. Does a lot of damage. Come on. Ah, alright, so the uh, spikes don't seem to affect him. Come on, you. Oh, my... My own bomb fly kind of uh, sniped him. Rotten baby, an infested friend. If you haven't already kind of picked up, this game is really fucking twisted. Uh, it's just a really strange game. Ah, money. Let's see what this does. More bombs? I don't actually know what this does. I've never seen this before. Oh, that'll take you right down. I, I actually don't want to go right down, though. That's cool, I guess, but then you miss out on the item. And I still want the boss's item. Come here. Oh, jumping once. Oh, fuck. I, I thought he was a different type. Ah. And see, that's kind of what happens, too, if you stop paying attention. Uh, we are going to go back to the shop. What are we looking at here? Oh, shit. Why didn't you have that charged? Oh, you know what? I'll bet you it's my rotten baby who's spitting out pheromones. Okay. All right. These are uh, mom hands. So kind of like uh, Legend of Zelda, uh, if the mom hands hit you, they bring you back to the beginning of the map. Oh, wow. I didn't know you shot multiple times like that. Yeah, part of it is just learning the enemies, too. I said I've beaten it a couple times, but you still run across, uh, well, not even different enemies, but enemies that just, they don't always do the same things. That's not true. They always do the same things. They don't always do all of their moves. Is a better... Fuck! Greed! <sighs> That's annoying. It ended up not being bad. Mysterious candy. I actually don't know what that does. I'm going to go with this missing page because it sounds cooler. I may be making really bad choices too. Uh, but, you know. Let's check out this next room. 
Yeah, and the leapers, they're kind of annoying. This little dude with flies, though, is pretty sweet. Anything good in here? Probably, but I don't want to risk it. If I had some spirit hearts left, I might, uh, but I'm getting pretty close to the womb. Um, and the difference is, so you've got the depths here. I've got a boss that I have to fight here. I've got mom that I'm going to fight on the next level. Is that colored rock? No, I'm just retarded. Um, so you've got mom on the next level, and then in the, uh, the level after that, the womb, you take double damage. So it does become... Oh my god! How did I... I walked right into it. And I'm... Jeez, I'm doing really bad for this. This is not the time to start choking. Monsters should be a very easy fight that you never take damage on. But another heart up. The spirit. Uh, if I wasn't already flying, that would be really good. But I'm already flying. Balls of steel, very good. Two spirit hearts. And bombs are key. Great. Now I have a ton of keys that I never will need. Um, yeah. I, oh, I thought balls of steel gave two spirit hearts. Interesting. In fact, I could have sworn it did. Oh, well. Uh, the little battery there, not that it'll be specifically useful for me right now, it, it just recharges your item. Oh, I didn't even see you guys there. Keep spitting flies! That infected baby is pretty sweet. Um... You definitely, as a note, unless things have changed from Rebirth, uh, you don't want to fight Mom early because it locks the room. And you can't get back out without an item, like a, a teleporter or something that would normally get you out of that or a card or something like that. So uh, you definitely want to make sure you're done with the room before you fight Mom. But the mom fight's pretty fun. Mom's womb is completely changed. If uh, if you haven't played Rebirth with that, hopefully we'll see mom's womb. 99 bombs. Well, that... See, part of... Part of the, the annoyance... I don't even know what that is. Starter deck. Extra card room. Okay. Two of hearts. All right. I'll give us some hearts. I don't actually know what this does either. But it, it accumulates through your games. And it eventually jams. There's options. Okay. Achievement unlocked! This is the first one I've seen that hasn't jammed, like, right away. Normally I put in, like, two and it jams. Oh, we have 99 bombs. What am I doing? So you can throw in coins and gamble with it. Uh, really not worth it to me, to be honest with you, because I've already got full. And that should, yeah. Said so the bomb fight is is pretty fun. Uh, a lot of this game is is just once you start to get it. It's it's not so hard. I remember these. I don't know what it does though. Ah, oh shit. Well, I've got plenty of keys, so it doesn't really matter. You can blow that up there. Oh, maybe I do have to use tears. Uh, but yeah, golden poo is generally just a lot of. Oh god, stop it. <laughs> Who's still alive? Nothing. Okay. That was odd. 
like trying to scan the room quickly, figuring out what the hell's still alive, and... Oh, fuck me! Should have seen that coming. Oh, I, I didn't even see... Where did you come from? Come on. I actually don't even see my hearts anymore. I, I don't know where my hearts all went. What happened to my hearts? Is that just a gimmick of this? I don't think I've ever seen all my hearts disappear before. I wonder if I'm one hit away and like something glitched. Uh, that's... That's not normally something that happens, folks. It very well could be just a gimmick of this level. Um, as part of the roguelike, they do throw in like these weird gimmicks, but... There are no shops after this floor, by the way, either, which is why I'm not holding onto my money. Unless that's changed, but... I wonder if that's going to just be a 999 coin type thing that... So we'll, we'll start off with our Book of Belial. And that's the main fight, is Mom's foot coming down. And her eyes and hands coming out. I may have been hit there, I'm not sh actually sure. Uh, my damage is through the roof though. Mom fight is generally much harder than this. What the hell is that? Torn photo, tears and speed shot. Okay. Oh, that, that does charge faster. I'm happy. What is the devil gonna offer me? I don't know what it is and I'm not gonna take it. Again, probably really good stuff, but please say I get my hearts back. Okay. I'm thinking it was a gimmick of that level then that after I get hit, uh, you're going to start to see that utero is where the game, well, the womb is where the game really picks up in difficulty. Um, generally, the first, ah, fuck. The first areas are more or less just um, trial, you know, getting into it. You should pretty much always, well, that's not true. Um, once you kind of get used to the game, you should pretty much always be able to beat, uh, Mom. Fuck! I'm not playing well. Safety cap. I'm not sure I'm gonna win. I'm playing kind of poorly, and I'm a little bit... I don't have the best makeup of items either. I don't know if I have enough life to pull this out. But, by God, I will try. I definitely have a lot of damage. I'm not as worried about my damage... Uh, if I can get to Mom's heart, I think I can win. I think I can do... I can just um, do enough damage to take out Mom's heart. Especially... Ah, oh, fuck the poo! God. And it's shit like that. It's stupid moves like that that this game will, like, kill you for. Fuck. Oh, well, that's true, though. I... Oh, no, he's not hes not who I thought he was. Fuck him. They normally don't do anything when they explode. That was new. Oh, this is not good. Oh, that could have been really tough. Penis dudes? 
pretty much everything looks like a penis in this game in some way. I don't really want to do a challenge room. That's not good. That's why flight is so important, though. Flight will get you out of really bad situations. Oh. And it'll get you into good ones. Whatever, I have 99 bombs. Oh! -hoo -hoo. Almost walked right into them. Come on up. All right. All right, boss time. The cage. I don't actually know this one at all. It seems kind of douchey, though. I don't know if I fly over them. But you can see my damage is really strong. I constantly do little flies of damage. I think... Uh, this is just a box of stuff. Yeah, just a bunch of items. Oh, God! Get away! Get away! Get away! All right. See the world. Open your eyes. That's not bad. Temperance. Is that the health? Yeah, it's the blood bank. The mark. Oh, do I take the... Fuck yeah. Mark is extra damage. Um, Alright, I'm not going to risk any life in there. We're just going to go and do this. We have the world. So... Oh, curse of darkness from... Are you kidding me? That's really bad luck. That is... That's really bad luck. Alright, I'm going to try and bypass a room. I mean, obviously you can see why darkness is so bad. The game really relies upon you trying to see everything. Thankfully, I've had a pretty easy path so far, and I just jinxed myself, I'm sure. Oh, I didn't even see that spider dude there. Thank God he shot. Go away! Alright, this is just Isaac. Fuck. Penis guy. Come on, penis. Come out. Come out, penis. Ah, oh, shit. Piercing shots? Oh, God, I almost hit the... All right, so I've got four... Oh, man. All right. This is just unfair, though. Giving me fucking darkness? Oh. And that's the Binding of Isaac. What is the devil room here? I've actually never gotten this before. We're going to go down. Code hanger has appeared. So this is the... So not the last... But oh my god, that is a lot of fucking... Bosses. I don't even see what hit me. Uh, again, the double damage still applies. There are some really broken... Oh, there's spiders. 
and that oh my god Uh, all right, I'm going to take my two of hearts, and I should have used that on my last. Oh, God. So these are just the basic rooms that you have to fight through. This isn't even the boss stuff. Uh, you can see where Binding of Isaac really ramps up its difficulty and decides to kick you in the nuts as hard as it can as often as possible. I don't know what they do. I am horrified, though. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. The lover's car. Yep, hearts. This is really stressful. <laughs> I may not be talking as much as... Uh, I, I've never gotten this far in Rebirth. Uh, this room has never been opened! Bomb flies. Or bomb penises, whatever you want to call them. Said it, like everything is... Oh, Monstro. Oh my god, Kevin, come on! That's what you're supposed to do, is get him stuck in a loop going back and forth like that. I'm not sure I can do this. Fucking demon things. Hoo 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 hoo. Blast him away. Fistula. Fistula isn't horrid, uh, especially with flight. So, like uh, again, you can see where flight. Thanks to flight, I can fly over, you know, stones and. These things can drop spirit hearts. Um, have an opportunity of it, but you have to blow them up. Considering how many bombs I have, even if just one spirit heart comes out, that was more than worth it. Oh, fuck! Well, there goes my one spirit heart. Another fistula. Oh, ho, 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 ho! It's amazing when you can kind of just catch yourself. Oh. Yeah, I'm stressed. That little rotten baby has been awesome. All right, a boss. This is normally a boss. Um, you shouldn't be too bad, though. Yeah. All right, let's take on Satan. Ow. Ow. Oh, God, that's new. Uh, actually, it's not new. And he goes into step three. Where his feet come down. And bomb fly should be coming out. But... Yes! Bam!
Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed uh, The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. It's it's a lot of fun. I really recommend it. I'll probably do some more of these because I, I do find them very, very fun. But uh, that's The Binding of Isaac hard. So, as always, folks, thanks for watching. Tune to the next. Thanks for watching, everybody.